Nearly half a billion mammals, birds, and reptiles are feared dead, according to ecologists from the University of Sydney. They're estimating 480 million animals have been lost since wildfires started ravaging Australia back in September, and more will suffer. As flames continue to run rampant through the states of Victoria and New South Wales, tons of homes along Australia's east coast have also been razed to the ground, leaving thousands of residents stranded and forcing many people to take shelter in the only place safe from the wildfire, the ocean. Harrowing images show captured kangaroos desperately attempting to flee great walls of flames while rescue teams have been met by the charred bodies of thousands of koalas. The estimated death toll included up to 8,000 koalas. According to the Federal Environment Minister Susan Lay, who tells ABC Radio that up to 30% of the species in New South Wales may have been completely wiped out. The area is home to a huge portion of Australia's koalas, with an estimated population of between 15,000 to 28,000. Once the fires calm down or cease altogether an official estimation and assessment can be made, Lay says. But for now, it's clear that hundreds of millions of animals haven't survived. Koalas have been among the most vulnerable of Australia's native animals during the wildfires because they are slow-moving and only eat leaves from the eucalyptus tree, which are filled with oil, making them highly flammable. Nature Conservation Council ecologist Mark Graham told Australian Parliament that the fires have burned so hot and so fast that their mortality of local animals has been significant, especially those that reside in trees.